Hello, Galaxy! I'm here with Star Wars Radar once again to do a reaction. Or can I try that sentence one more time? I'm here with Star Wars Radar once again to do a Season 4 second trailer reaction. We're talking about Star Wars Rebels. And if you have not yet started watching that series, uh, no time like the present. This is the fourth and final season. Uh, they released the trailer earlier today. I have not had a chance to watch it, so I thought I would react to it with you virtually live if you happen to be tuning in live if you're not tuning in live uh you're probably watching this video after the fact in a higher quality on either our youtube channel or our facebook page which also includes our facebook group the community if you will so uh without further ado i'm going to react to the second trailer for season four the final season of star wars rebels i've been watching from the very beginning uh i will be uh sad to see it go but excited to watch the trailer so, I'm going to watch the trailer. Ezra. Oh, they're back on Lothal. Ah, oh, it's a Loth Wolf. Oh. And a Loth Cat. I'm still looking for a Loth Cat. Like, a stuffed creature. I shouldn't talk about that right now. Hang on. Ah, oh, Mandalorians! Whoa! Saga Rare's back. On Mothma. Death Troopers. Did a start? Ah! Uh -huh. I saw Hot Callus. Such wisdom. Maybe we're choosing the wrong one. X Wings in Rebels. Oh, I just feel like you've done enough for this rebellion. Was that Mart? I guess I never really thought about it. So I guess you really never thought about us. Us? Oh, I'm moving. I think it was Bo-Katan. Now is our time. I wish I could see you. You could always see me. <sighs> All the paths are coming together, right? I'm just not sure if we're going to like where they lead. I saw a new hairstyle, or at least color, for Sabine. Oh, wow. Oh, and it premieres on October 16th. That's awesome. I'm uh, I'm excited. I very much look forward to new Rebels episodes. We watch them frequently enough because Jedi likes watching them. And I almost want to watch the trailer again because I think there's a lot that I missed. But uh, I've said this about every Rebel season uh, after one, certainly, is you have to watch everything that came before it to understand or have the emotional connection with the characters that we see in season four. You can't just begin with season four. That was... Uh, that was looking like it, this is a good way to end the series, uh, potentially. Uh, I, I definitely like to see some closure. I don't want to see a, you know, a quick close uh, to Rebels outright. Certainly don't want it to be jarring. I want to know what happened with the, the characters. Uh, nice! <laughs> it looked action-packed. I, I thought Season 3 was great. I thought Season 2 was great. Season 1 took a lot to get into, but I'm ready for Season 
uh, for bringing on all those Mandalorians, uh, uh, space battles, uh, you know, the, the heroism, the romance, potentially, that's kind of what I heard if I'm reading between the lines or listening between the lines. Uh, a lot of references beyond Rebels, um, as I was kind of remarking as I was watching this, uh, Stardust. Uh, was brought up, which of course you know was Jin's nickname uh, from Galen, her father in uh, Rogue One. Uh, wow. Okay. Uh, any thoughts on Rebels? Am I the only one who watches Rebels out there? I I, I hope not. Uh, thank you for tuning in live for this reaction. If you did, and and if not, I love you. I appreciate you, and may the Force be with you. <laughs>